Hello YouTube! Today I'm going to cover 5 simple early game embellishments that can help inspire your pre-Stone Era builds in Valheim. I've been dabbling in Valheim building and only recently have found a lot of joy in discovering fun ways to organically build. I believe anyone can make amazing builds and I hope my ideas help you along your path to enjoyment and creativity. If you like the content, don't forget to subscribe and share. The idea that a rustic Viking lodge would be perfectly symmetrical just didn't sit well with me. And once I discarded that expectation, I noticed I began to enjoy building a lot more. Most of my tips will hopefully help get you out of the mindset of perfect symmetry and matching building pieces. Here are some specific thoughts to ponder in your building journey. Keeping to the idea of imperfect is perfect, I want to propose freeform walls, vertical walls, angled beam walls, staggered walls, and everything in between. These walls are simple, versatile, and allow for organic exploration in your build style, while also providing organized anchors for your eyes and a pleasing but deceptive sense of symmetry. I typically use a horizontal beam or space to align the beams, but you can just as easily eyeball the correct placement. You can stagger them, overlap, play with the gap width and height variety, slope and on and on. I like to mix wood types as well. You can create snap-free builds by toggling alternative placement while placing items. Keep in mind with the release of Valheim on the Xbox console as of March 14th, 2023, to double check the settings menu for the default hotkey for your system. In my Let's Play Valheim series linked here, I built a cozy kitchen house from scratch and taught myself this little building hack. I used it to recess some tapestry walls using banners, as well as adding interesting features like shelves and other fun decorations. You can also add mushrooms and wall lamps to add moody lighting. So many cool possibilities. Here is a recessed wall, additional vertical beam half walls, and a wraparound shelf slash bar that I created playing with dimensions within this space. Super easy to do and really fun to experiment with. It might sound weird, but my final tip today is to just let it all burn sometimes. Don't be afraid to just start over. Redo an entire wall, redecorate an entire room, raise a mountain from the sea, or flatten the highest peak. You can do whatever you want, and you can start over till it feels right to you. That's all for today. Be sure to subscribe and follow along if you enjoyed the content. I'm working on other simple vanilla build inspo videos for this lovely game, and I invite you to come along. This video features builds I created on Berryheim, the official Mollyberry Patreon server. Special thank you to my supporters over on Patreon. If you like the content, 
please consider supporting the channel while also sneaking behind the scenes with post stream recaps, exclusive merch, private game servers, and more over at patreon.com slash mollyberry. Link in the description. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Hey, hey, Psst. yeah, yeah, you, you're still here? Hey, uh, do me a favor, click on one of these uh, links on this page and and check out that subscribe button down there and like the, the like button and share this with your mom on Facebook or something. Okay, thanks. See you next time. As you were. <clears throat>